Hey y'all, I wanna give everybody a quick update um on my fourth week of chemo radiation. I forgot to mention for my last update what the uh, radiation tech told me after my first week. He said no hot food, no cold food, no fried food, no spicy food. Four things. And in my mind I'm thinking, dude, that's all my food groups. Just because he doesn't want any of those to irritate my throat after that first week because uh, it's not going to get any better from there from the side effects. So now that in my full week of radio chem uh, radi I'm sorry, chemo radiation, I'm feeling more exhausted than before. Uh, this literally made my first round of uh, chemo a piece of cake. Uh, my taste buds are about 80% gone. Nothing tastes good at all. Um, everything feels really dry and uh, rough and tough in my mouth. Mostly when the food or the object is in my mouth, I could kind of feel like it's really rough working, r rubbing on against on the top of my tongue. So that's a little bit difficult. So I, I stated in my previous videos before that um, my weight was at 257 because I was gaining weight to uh, compensate for the stuff I was going to lose. And yesterday when I weigh in, I was at 240. So between the first week to now, I went from 257 to 240. And from last week to this week, I lost 8 pounds in one week. So when I went to see the radiation doctor, he was not cool with me losing 8 pounds in a week. And um, he, need, he told me to, I need to step up on my calorie intake at least 2,000 a day. It's a little bit tough with um, not eating as much and nothing tastes good, but you know, he reminded me I'm eating to survive while before, you know, a lot of people were eating for pleasure. So I need to eat to survive. So I do have a plan to keep up with that. I went ahead and ordered some uh, high calorie uh, protein powder yesterday. It should be here today because I'm already starting making my own shakes with. Um, the high calorie ice cream or frozen yogurt and mixed with almond milk. So with the help of that protein powder, I believe one scoop is about 620 and the recommend uh, scoop is like two. So I'm hoping to get at least 1200 from one shake. So that would uh, at least knock out half of what I need to intake. And I'm at the same time, I'm trying to eat soups and other solid food with um, a lot of gravy. Um, if I could help it Which is good because I had to keep up with my liquids too. So hopefully with the shakes and the food and my origin well, or original water uh, Would help that I'm currently also drinking a 50 milliliter No, wait, not 50 milliliter. It's a 1.5 liter which equals to 50 ounces. I'm been drinking that every day uh, So we'll see how that's how that's all gonna go. So until next time, uh, I'll keep you guys updated.